I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready for this review. Yeah. From the early days of Crash Bandicoot to the moment. stuff like review no, another back in time marathon game known as Marathon Bikini Bottom, the GameCube game. Yeah. I already reviewed Rehydrated, so now I'm gonna review the classic. Okay, here we go. Yeah. So yeah. Here you can play as SpongeBob, not only SpongeBob, but Patrick and Sandy as well. Each with their own pro cons and abilities. Yeah. And uh, uh, and there's Squidward. Yeah. <laughs> Everything is tilted here, and the graffiti is the same. Yeah. As in the rehydrated version. And of course, there's Gary. Up, and there's Rock Bottom, of course. And you get to fight robots as well. Yeah. And of course, the Head Bash. Yeah, with this, yeah, when you bash into floating boxes. Of course, Patrick's body slam, as, as seen in Crash Bandicoot, yeah. Yeah, and of course, there's always a lagoon. Goo Lagoo, for instance. So, yeah. How about that? So, and, of course, there's always, always, when, there's always, and I always, Fight the hammer robot, and you get to collect golden spatulas as well. There's all kinds of robots to battle. There's hammer, hammer robots, tartarus robots, spinning robots, and all sleepy time robots, giant oil robots, and all reminds me of a TNT crate. <laughs> Many different kinds of robots. I know Adam so glad to have to do the bat on Monday. Oh, and here's a sleepy oh, yeah, time yeah. robot. Yeah. What he tells you. He wants to do Oh, how about that? He tells me that too. He wants to do a date, but he knows he can. He just wants to. I'll be careful not to run up to him, can't, can't him or else she'll get zapped. <laughs> yeah. And of course, there's always rock bottom to come across. Yeah, of course. And be careful not to fall off the edge, or else you'll have to get back to where you were because of Hans. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, roller ball. You have to get use the roller ball for this. Like bowling. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. And of course, there's bosses to do. Uh, and look, there's Mermaid Man, Larry the Lobster, and there's Sandy's. And here's where you get to play as Sandy. Yeah. And you can save Patrick from the robots at Jellyfish Fields before you get to play as him. Yeah, of course. So, there are many abilities to come across, like bubble power and head smash and rollerball. 
cool. And this, yeah. yeah. The, the spin, yeah. Hmm. Just like Fresh Bandicoot, yeah. You see, licensed video games of that time are supposed to be not that good. But when co one comes around, you're gonna get a decent time. So, yeah. What made the original Battle for Bikini Bottom feel very special was that, unlike the other, hey look, there's Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy here, of course. No, I'm not. When I do see him, I, as I was saying, what made the original Battle for Bikini Bottom, other than the rehydrated Battle for Bikini Bottom, both feel kind of special was that they weren't garbage. Licensed video games of that era are supposed to not be good. So when, you, so when one comes around, you're gonna get a good time of gameplay. Yeah. How about that? Did you see? Yeah, So you better watch out for these oil robots or else you'll get back to where you were without a checkpoint that is. And there's Sandy's dream. Yeah. And there's Larry. And there's where you get to play as Sandy. Yeah. One of the levels. Yeah. Of course. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and the lasso for Sandy Swing is very fun. It's still very fun to this day. Even in Rehydrated, which they fixed. Of course. I don't care what other people say about Sandy's lasso swing and Rehydrated. It's still good. Yeah. So, yeah. I said this in my original Rehydrated video, but yeah, of course. And it's also nice that I get to And of course you get to feed the clam shiny objects here as well as paying Mr. Krabs for shiny objects. And this means that Mr. Krabs and Mermaid Man still have their wildly inaccurate voices, even in the original. Yeah, but I don't mind that. It's okay. Yeah. Of course. And there's also... And of course, there's the Goo Lagoo. Of course. There's always smashing boxes full of shiny objects. Yeah, of course. And uh, and there's always. And here you get to save save everyone's skin from peeling by defeating that robot with light beams from the light hat, from the lifeguard chairs and you better watch out for that thunder robot or else you get zapped of course by lightning <laughs> platforming and squidward's dream can sometimes be a total nightmare yeah but i don't mind even if rehydrated it's still good oh and the sliding there's always the sliding even in rehydrated it's still good in my opinion, yeah, it's always my opinion. Everything I say is just my opinion, yeah, of course. Oh, and here you get to be Larry, Mrs. Puff, and Bubble Buddy's times, as in the Kelp Forest, you get to be Mermaid Man's time, yeah. And of course, yeah, there's always. A sliding mission and of course once you enter the bowling 
rollerball area at before you when you see the credits you get when you get 100 percent you get to see the characters sing the theme song yeah unlike rehydrated once when you completed the robo spongebob and neutralized the giant rope giant spongebob robot's brain you get after the final cutscene you get the ending get the secret ending where everyone sings the theme song yeah so that's the end so don't forget to like comment and hit that subscribe button and make sure you give this a big thumbs up and until then take care